In this video, we have compiled a list of some of the worst mistakes to avoid in crypto. Now, some might seem a little too obvious, but most not so much. So watch the whole video to find out. Mistake number one, falling victim to your own emotions. In the crypto world, emotion and hype play a big role in investors' decisions. For example, acting out of FOMO. Say Mary is hyped up by her friend to buy into a coin that has been blowing up. Or maybe she encounters a rags to riches story from a YouTuber who perfectly timed the bottom and top of coin X. Since Mary doesn't want to miss out, she makes investment decisions solely out of FOMO. Remember, hearing somebody else's success story is not an investment thesis. Tip, on top of doing your research, have a plan for your investments. This will help you block out the outside noise and make informed investment decisions. Mistake number two, sending your cryptocurrency to the wrong wallet. The thought of sending Bitcoin to the wrong address can be scary, even for crypto veterans. That said, the most common mistakes are often the easiest to avoid. You could be sending crypto from an exchange wallet to another digital wallet or even sending crypto to a friend only to mistype the wallet address. When this happens, the crypto is sent to an erroneous wallet address and in most cases, it's unrecoverable. Tip, instead of typing out the address, copy and paste the address into the recipient field. Once you are ready to send, cross check the address and then check it again. Another good practice is to send out a test amount like $10 first before the actual full amount. Moving on to mistake number three, ignoring fees. New investors might jump into purchasing crypto without understanding how the fees work on exchanges. For example, while making crypto purchases with a credit card is simple and instant, it incurs higher transaction fees. Now, learning and paying attention to fees might feel insignificant in the short term, but it can save you a lot of money in the long term. Gas fees on networks like Ethereum are calculated based on network congestion and hence can turn a simple, inexpensive transaction into a costly nightmare. And the worst case scenario being the gas costing more than the value of the transaction itself. Here's a tip to avoid paying overly excessive gas fees. Find a time when gas is relatively low by checking sites like Etherscan. Next up, mistake four, keeping your crypto wealth in hot wallets or exchanges. Always remember the saying, not your keys, not your coins. Even if it might seem like you actually own the coins on your exchange account, you are not in total control of them. That said, moving your crypto to a hot wallet may not be enough security-wise. Hot wallets, they're always online and connected to the blockchain, so they are more prone to vulnerabilities and hackers can drain your wallet through crypto scams or hacks. Now, cold wallets are less convenient, but reduce the risk of getting hacked. Tip. Consider storing the majority of your crypto and hardware wallets instead of on an exchange unless you plan to actively trade it. Next up is giving out your seed phrase and getting scammed. The current crypto environment is littered with bad actors looking to steal your hard-earned money and social media platforms have proven to be a hot bet for them. Now, unfortunately, efforts from the platforms have not been enough to root them out since they are still at large. So it is your responsibility to stay safe and vigilant. Scam artists are getting more creative by the day. For instance, 
You can be scammed into entering your seed phrase into a site that you think is legitimate and secure, but it is actually a duplicate phishing landing page. Always remember that the seed phrase effectively affords the same opportunities to drain your savings as the private key. So protect it just as much. Tip, never reveal your seed phrase to anyone. Never, ever, don't do it. Enter it only to recover access to your wallet. Now, mistake six is especially relevant for new crypto investors. That is trading using leverage. In crypto trading, leverage increases your purchasing power, allowing you to trade with more money than you actually have, even up to 100 times your account balance. This means that your profits are multiplied. However, if a trade goes poorly, leverage works against you and can multiply your losses as well. Now, new crypto investors would do better to avoid trading with leverage or attempting any other sophisticated techniques and doing so only after gaining sufficient experience. Moving on to mistake seven, short-term thinking. Many new investors may fall into the trap of getting into crypto to get rich quick. And of course, there is a possibility of making massive gains. However, there is also a possibility of losing all your funds to a, a bad investment move. Now, depending on your financial goals, consider having a mindset shift. This way you will choose your crypto investments more carefully and concentrate on picking higher quality projects with long track records. Tip, having a long-term investment plan may help you to stay convicted, especially when the prices fall dramatically. Mistake number eight is failing to diversify your portfolio. Now, as they say, don't put all your eggs in one basket. You should consider spreading your money out among different digital currencies. This means you don't take risk being overexposed should one of them plummet in value, especially since the market prices of digital assets are highly volatile. So just do your research on the many projects out there and hand pick the quality ones you believe have a high potential. Now on to the second last mistake, investing more than you can afford to lose. Most people out there will give trading tips, however, they might not have your best interests at heart. Plus, everyone has different financial goals and different amounts of risk that they are willing to stomach. Don't forget that crypto is a high risk asset and many traders are already losing money. So don't let anyone trick you with surefire trading methods for guaranteed profits. Here's my tip, set limits on how much you invest in a particular digital currency and do not be tempted to trade with more money than you can afford to lose. Last but not least, not doing your own research. DYOR, a word that you will hear a lot in the world of crypto and for a good reason. There are so many people and even projects in crypto that are not genuine. Therefore, it is your responsibility to go out of your way and carry out proper research on projects before choosing to invest. So here's my tip. Watch this helpful guide on doing your own research and find out what other investors are doing to make informed investment decisions. And also be sure to let us know in the comments if you have made any of these mistakes.